Hi everyone, and welcome to the 12th annual University of Waterloo Teaching and Learning Conference. We wanted to give you a little bit of a walkthrough in advance of the conference, which again is occurring Wednesday, April 28th and Thursday, April 29th, so that when it comes time to join the conference on that Wednesday, you'll at least have a bit of an idea of what to expect and to be able to navigate the space effectively. So very briefly, when you log in for the first time, you'll be on this lobby stage and it looks pretty similar to the other parts of the conference platform, but here is where we house pertinent information about what's coming up with the conference uh, in this feed area, as well as some gamification elements that will occur throughout the conference. Uh, if you ever find yourself stuck, there's a welcome booth here, which will have information, some FAQs, some documents, as well as an overview of what the different sessions all entail. You can, of course, as well, edit your profile here at the top by clicking on your name and then changing, you know, adding a profile picture or adding some other information about yourself as well. Now on the left hand side here in this blue column is how you'll access each of the individual parts of the conference. So the main stage area is where you'll find our keynotes and ignite our practice sessions as well as any other breaks. We'll have some entertainment playing during the breaks again in that main stage. The rest of these are fairly self-explanatory presentations is where you'll find the 15 minute presentations as well as the Q&As to follow. The workshops and panels house the more interactive sessions that are 55 minutes in length. And the posters and showcases are where you'll find the posters and assessment showcases, which you can check out at any point in time. But specifically, we do have time dedicated Wednesday afternoon to look at those together. Lounges are a social space that we'll have available uh, again throughout the conference, but specifically Wednesday at 4.30 and that's a chance to talk to your colleagues about things both academic and non-academic related. And finally, in the people profile, this is where you can see other people. And if you want to connect with someone by sending them a direct message or uh, by scheduling a video chat with them as well. On the right hand side then is the chat feature. And this is where you can communicate with your fellow conference attendees throughout the conference and talk about whatever you like, or of course, ask questions to the presenters whose presentations or workshops or panels you're attending. That's basically the conference in a nutshell. One final piece we'd like to encourage you to do is both A, please try to use Google Chrome when you're accessing the conference. We find it works best using Google Chrome. And secondly, when you are in Google Chrome, one of the first things you'll want to do is at the very top, next to the URL, click this little light lock icon there and make sure that Excelevance is accessing both your camera and microphone. Even though as an attendee, you won't really need to use those most likely, it will ensure that you can hear and see the presentations throughout the conference. So we hope that is uh, helps make things a little bit more clear for you. If you have any questions, of course, please feel free to get in touch in advance. And again, on the day of the conference, just check out the welcome booth if you're ever stuck and we'll make sure to get you the support that you need. We hope you have a great time at the conference and we look forward to learning with you.